got to support the union. Um, it's an important time. We're all fighting for a fair contract. Writers Guild as well. Screen Actors Guild. Obviously, there's a lot of really good support out here. And um, I think just an important time. I'm standing with the union and, and hoping we all get a fair and equitable contract. You need to pay people so that our lives can be vibrant, so that we are vibrant with each other, so that our communities are vibrant. Producers having money has not made the world a better place ever. So if paying people makes your world a better place. So we want better parks, we want better libraries, we want things to go better. You pay your laborers and that's what we need to make sure we're doing. Uh, and with that we stay, that the union stays strong. I'm here because I'm a writer. SAG actress. I'm the Writers Guild of America. I've been a full-time actor the last seven years. Fellow actors or fellow um, writers out here just in unity. I couldn't work without writers. Real writers. I don't want to work for a robot. If there is going to be AI in the future, there needs to be some sort of fair deal about it. They can't pay actors a half day's rate and use our likeness forever however they want. That's not fair. Personally, I think streaming residuals need to be boosted. They've gotten away with far too low of a rate for far too long. It's clearly a profitable model. So much so that they are paying their CEOs at Netflix, you know, like 20 million, 40 million dollars in bonuses a year. Why can't they divvy up some of that for writers and actors, the people that are actually creating the product, the content, which without, they would not be profiting at all? AI. Yeah. AI is the one that matters because I'm not someone like, I understand there's going to be more AI involvement just as the world, you know, and life progresses. But I think that if you take the humanity out of the arts, then what are you, what are we actually doing? Like, I think this story has the power to actually change the world. What people aren't understanding is that what we're fighting for, even though um, Hollywood, so to speak, sometimes can seem sort of uh, distant for a lot of America, I think a lot of the things we're fighting for are issues across all industries. So it's these giant corporations, conglomerates, um, not taking the needs of their employees seriously and not valuing us for what we're worth. And I think that's something that is uh, permeating across the labor movement entirely. But the business has changed, you know, very, very much so in a lot of good ways. There's more of it, but there's less structure for financial re recoup. I mean, for only the top. A lot of young workers can't afford to live. But the reality is, is that film, television, content creation, it's a collaborative effort. It wouldn't exist without us. We need them just as much as they need us, if they don't need us more. You know what I mean? So it's time that we get recognized for our contribution.